Everybody's talking a lot about the group builds at the moment. And personally, just for me, I love them. I think it's a way to get engaged with the community. I know there's something going on right now, but it's something that, you know, it kind of pushes you to build a little better, a little more, possibly a little better because, you know, you are, you're not really competing against anybody at the same time. You, you kind of are in a sense, you know, because you're, you're putting it out there. You're putting your work out there and people are going to compare it to other people. So, you know, and that, I think that can be frustrating for some people. You know, maybe they don't want to go down that road. Um, for me personally, I know there's a lot of better builders out there than me, so I'm not too concerned with it. <laughs> I'm just, I'm honestly out there to have fun and have a good time with it <laughs> and come up with some amazing pieces of art because I really our, consider our model building art. You know, it's um, it's an art form. It may not be your typical painting on a canvas, that sort of thing. But at the same time, it's definitely an art form. You know, we're putting our our ideas into it, our, our artistic touches into this model, most models. Um, we're coming up with different designs. And a lot of times by the time you're done, it doesn't look anything like the box art or, you know, sometimes it does. And, and I don't have anything against that. I'm just not a big box art type. I, I don't build anything stock. And, and like I was saying earlier, everything for me changes as I'm building. I will come up with different ideas and different ways to try that. Try this, try that. That is um, one of the big reasons I love the USAC build. Because I know that there's going to be some amazing builds going on. So it pushes me personally to try new things and to try to make this thing that much better. And so... For me, that's what it, it, it's really important. That's why I love group builds because it does push me a little bit in maybe directions no, that wouldn't have gone because I know that there's going to be so many amazing builds coming out that um, I want mine to to look nice, to look good. You know, I want people to look at it and be like, wow, that's pretty cool. I'd never thought of that before. And that to me is the artistic touch that we that we bring to this community, that we bring, you know, to our model building. And so, yeah, I'll quit rambling. <laughs> so um, I'm really glad we're having this discussion, though, because I, I think, you know, I've heard some people say, oh, there's too many group builds. and But, you know, really, you just pick which ones you want to go on, you know. And if I have only well, people please. on my group build, that'll be great. That'll be fine. You know, it's not that big of a deal to me. Um, I would love it if people join, but if they don't, you know, it's it's not the end of the world. Um, I think group builds are also a great way to promote your channel. Hopefully when they do their videos, when other creators do their videos, they're going to mention you that this is the so-and-so's group build. And so, yeah, it's a great way to build your, build your channel. Like I said before, just kind of push yourself in maybe a new direction that you hadn't really thought of going before. And that's what, personally, I love about it. So... All right, I'll get off my soapbox, and I hope you guys have a great day. Have some time to do some model building and relax, and I will talk to you soon. Thanks a lot, guys. Bye-bye.